Hold up, draft time. Um, I ran into some shit yesterday that was unfucking believable. I was at work, right? <clears throat> and I was taking the escalator going up to the next level of the building I was in. Somebody called up to me from downstairs and even asked me something. So I, once I got up top, I hopped back on the escalator going down. Um, all of a sudden the escalator stopped. Look around, look up front. There's this couple, black couple. Young lady had this super long, slinky going out dress, which was totally inappropriate for the place and the occasion that she was there for. That's beside the point. But her dress got caught in the escalator and stopped it. So, I walk down the stairs, I walk down the escalator, past her and the dude that she was with. She was trying to get the dress out of the escalator. He was trying to, too. And I go on, I talk to the person that needed to talk to me. Somebody comes up, because I work there, and asks, oh, aren't you going to help that lady with her dress? my rationale and I said it's like no oh, she's got a man with her he can do it so he couldn't get the dress out of the escalator so I go over there reach down pull the dress out of the escalator without tearing it she had torn she and he had both torn up the dress a little bit while trying to get it out but I was able to tear it out with no problem now right after got it out and mind you these was hood these was some hood niggas woman immediately started saying well who can I go to about this dress this ain't no cheap dress you know and it's ruined and this nigga that she's with who couldn't get the dress out of the uh, escalator and mind you he was not he was not a little dude he was bigger than me he was a big dude he started up, yeah, man, oh, that dress ain't cheap, man. It, it, it needs to be replaced. So I was like, all right. Well, I'll take you up to building services. You know, maybe they can at least get you in the right direction. So she's walking with me. He stays his ass downstairs. So, and she was kind of an around the way looking chick. You know the type. She short kind of pudgy you know has some tig old bitties weave you know she looked had that round the way look you know she like a chick who could liven up a dull Saturday or Sunday afternoon you know roll by there kick it give a couple packs of new ports or a fifth or whatever and be on your way but um, I asked her, ma'am, is that your man? She was like, yeah. It sounded real disgusted by it. I said, so, yeah. And it's like, he couldn't get your dress out of the escalator. I was like, no, nah, he couldn't. He, he can't fix nothing. You know, he don't do nothing. Just like, he's just, just totally useless. All the while, she's, I guess, calling herself trying to flirt. I was like, well, ma'am, with all due respect, you picked him. And she just kind of had that look. And I'm like, you knew this boy, and I didn't say this, but I was thinking, you knew this nigga wasn't shit when you met him. You knew he probably didn't have a job. Probably didn't have a car. You know, he was he was just shit on a stick and you still opted to get with him. Made your bed, boo, lie in it. So let's face it, brothers. 
a lot of these women out here, they want useless ass niggas. They don't want anybody that's on point or even trying to be on point. 